Hey everyone, quick promo, this week's channel member gaming video is me playing Buckshot Roulette, which is a weird, very weird game, but anyway, enjoy. And there we know, welcome back to another video. What is up you guys? I'm Fresh Cut Slim, and today I'm gonna be reacting to Hell of a Boss, Murder Family, Season 1, Episode 1. I feel like my face is all messed up right now. What the freak's going on here? Ugh. Ugh. Anyway, this is recommended to me. This is so off. Oh my goodness. This is recommended to me. Hopefully this will be really funny. I think Brandon Rogers is in this. I'm pretty sure Brandon Rogers is in this, as well as I think other uh, celebrities are in this too. My eye is like, what the frick is going on here? I get to fix this. Anyway, let's get started. I'm going to fix it and then I'll get, we'll get started here. Anyway, as I was saying, Brandon Rogers is in this, I believe. I am not really sure. I've had so many people re uh, request me to react to this. And it's been up for around three years now. This is by Vizzy Pop. I'm not really sure what else, you know, to expect from this. But, uh, nonetheless, with that being said, let's begin. I was a good person before it all went down. I was good my entire life. Good morning! I hope you all did your homework. We this cartoon is really well done. Love to do our homework, and we love our teacher too. And when I throw out these fun questions, you should know just what to do. Okay. Two plus six is eight, and good behavior is eight. And it's now that part of the class when we say the time of day and date. It's nine in the morning on January 8th. The sun is out of spring. And it's your husband's birthday. La 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 la. Where's this going? I feel like this is kind of misleading. Like, this is not actually how it's supposed to go. I think this is like a fake out. There's a bad kid in the corner. There's there was a there was a bad kid in the corner. Did you see? But right here, he's sitting here in the corner. Okay. Is he having a mental breakdown already? My stars! Stop singing, children. Hush up now! I forgot it's my husband's birthday. I didn't get him anything special. Maybe if we call him, we could do a happy birthday surprise. Okay. Oh yeah, right there. You. <laughs> hey, he's cheating. Oh, that's not good. Right there. Oh yeah. That's right there. My asshole. But I don't care. Yeah, <laughs> oh, that's so awkward. And all the kids are behind seeing this. Not there. Not there. Not Okay. Yeah. You got like the squeaky toy sounds going on. <laughs> That's so funny. Remember what you taught us? Think before you act. Uh oh, she got crazy. Okay. Oh shit, sweetie. And they just left that on. They she didn't even turn it off. <laughs> Done. She had a family. We could have had a family. Oh dear God, what have I done? In front of you all. I'm so sorry, my children. Don't forget to work on your time table. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget that this is a test tomorrow. Make sure you study. You do everything right in life. Play by all the rules. And still get sent down here with all the Hitlers and Epsteins of the world after one measly massacre propelled by blind rage. So that's why I'm here. To get my revenge. I mean, was she hotter? I'm just saying, I had a hard time understanding the unprompted melodrama you just spat at me. That's it. This is Brad Brandon Rogers. I recognize that voice anywhere. That's freaking Brandon. It's. Anyway, I don't think you quite understand how we're operating down here. See, we take revenge out on the living, and it sounds like the core cast of your sitcom of a death, frankly, are all probably down here in hell with you. So, did, wait, did she, did she, did she die or something? She, she's down here, so she must have died. I must have missed something. How did she die? Did she, like, off herself, or did she, someone take her out? Not all of them. That whore survived. Now they all call her a hero. How does it feel to have survived such a crazy bitch? I just hope that sick woman finally found peace. 
You are so brave. Here's two million dollars. Oh, thank you. Between the talk shows and donation bullshit, she made so much goddamn cash. Getting shot was the best thing to happen to her. You're a hero. You're a hero, girl. My mama's a hero. She is a hero. I kind of paused on the probably the worst timing right here. Regardless. Also, why would you have a picture of your family right here when you're doing this? Like, this, this seems kind of inappropriate, I think. <laughs> I was going to say. Frick, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah. So if she only got shot, but then didn't live, like, what happened? Did I guess the lady must have got killed or something. <laughs> You're a hero! You're a hero! You're a hero! Oh, 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 you a... Wait, so someone else is cheating on her? A hero! She is not a hero! <laughs> mm-hmm, yeah, okay, yeah, my thoughts, exactly. <laughs> You're a horo? <laughs> I don't know. Wait, what were the options there? Okay, yeah, my thoughts exactly. <laughs> Deranged client, so that's what she is. Horny client. <laughs> client giving birth. Stoleless, I don't know what that means. Ghost, spoiled my pants, that's an emergency for sure. This one should be a big red button. <laughs> More coffee, that's also an emergency. Speaking of coffee, cheers. Moxie, stop shaking! You're gonna shoot our only hail ham. Wow, I feel so loved here. Just take a deep breath and let it out. But it's a family. Under what circumstances would we ever need to kill a human family? I mean, if that's what the client wants. Maybe like a shitty dad or a mob family. That's understandable. But to eradicate an entire innocent, seemingly in this instance, upper middle... This voice that, that, that I'm hearing from that guy, that sounds familiar too. I don't know who it is, if it's another famous person, but it sounds familiar. So are these guys like, like hitmen or something? Middle class family bloodline? Hey, you don't know they're innocent. This kid probably sets dogs on fire. Maybe this girl gets off to bullying Australian kids online. And this guy, this guy definitely watched. This guy goes to the back rooms and does inappropriate things through holes. <laughs> Exactly. Humans are full of secret nasties. It's why so many of them end up here. But guilty and innocent aren't our business, Mox. Killing who we're paid to is our business. Shoot the target. I just think it's a bit excessive, and we could be a bit more selective, is all. Guys, I want you to meet. <laughs> our newest client. Damn it, Moxie! I just bought those eels! Okay, so I guess Brandon Rogers, whoever he- whoever this guy is, this boss is the owner of this hitman business in hell? Is that what's going on? Bye, and don't worry, we'll get that skank in less than 24 hours or your first kill is free! When did we start implementing that deal? When you set fire to my office in front of a client, you fucking dick shit! Now someone please tell me that fancy book is still intact! You mean, our only ticket to the other side? Yeah. What is this? Goat and asshole in the living world? Goat and asshole in the living world. What does that mean, goat? Like, that's not, that's greatest of all time? That doesn't make any sense. Come to IMP. Make sure you put put this sign on the right side. Don't F this up. Also, payment will take a couple weeks because it comes in the mail. Speech to text. But so, <laughs> that's an ad. Got it. And that's why you're my favorite, Looney. You get a tweet now. Ew, stop. He uh, wants a tweet. You're he so wants a tweet. gross. Aw, oh, stop it. I get enough of that from my therapist. Now let's go. I take it that Fox character appeals to a lot of, like, furries. Blitz the ass! The expression is kick some ass. Blitz. Mine's better. Oh, fuck. That's gotta be her. <laughs> this is too easy. Moxie, do you want this one? Me? 
Yeah, this one's simple enough for you to handle. It's just a happy mother who just got out of the hospital. Snooze you lose, Mox. And I got you, bitch. Wait, are we actually killing a family? No, don't be a puss. We're just the wife. Just the wife. We're just killing a mother. <laughs> yeah. I actually really like this show. This is, like, it's well done. The animation is really well done. It's charming. It's got Brandon Rogers. And I love Brandon Rogers, so that's automatically a bonus. I really like this. We're ruining a family. But, hold, hold on, hold on. Let's just think about this. <laughs> what was that, Ralphie? I don't know, Martha. But whatever it is, they're gonna be tomorrow night's dinner. All right. Your average Texan. <laughs> Looks like we got some Beach bar that dinner, boys. <laughs> what the fuck was that, Moxie? I'm sorry. They just seem so wholesome and happy. I panicked. Oh, who the fuck is innocent, Moxie? From the moment of birth, you're already a parasite leeching off your mama's tits. Get the fuck over yourself, you baby dick prick! Oh, a new hole! Scatter! <laughs> 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 Isn't this guy at least somewhat curious to what the frig that was that he just grabbed with a tail like that? Y'all can't hide long from me. I don't like that face. Maybe you should have taken out the whole family. <laughs> this guy's up to no good. Oh! Well, hello, little ones. Aren't you cute? It's nice to have, have a new critter to play with. Play with. Oh man, I think that, you know, this family is definitely an effed up family. Oh, crumbs. <laughs> man, the shots, like the scenery in this is so well done. I love the colors. The colors in this are so well done. Like it's all blends together perfectly. Isn't it a bad time, Blitzy? What is it? I've been meaning. Is this is this his like partner or whatever? Need to follow up on our last little conversation regarding my grimoire. What did you just call me? My book, Blitzy. The book I was given to do my job that I have allowed you to use to do yours. I can hear you, darling. Shit. Anywho, I have been thinking. You know, I have been permitting you to access the mortal realm less than legally for some time now, but I do need it back to fulfill my duties. I was thinking, what if we worked out some kind of exchange? Is he pro propositioning him in an uh, inappropriate way? Is that what it sounds like that? Also, so he let this person let uh, Moxie, is that the name? I, I don't know the name, but let Brandon, whoever that character pl he plays, use the book so he can access the realm of the living, so he can actually perform his hits to work his business, I guess, right? Can you, like, can't, do you need the book specifically, or can you just, like, photocopy pages and then just read them? I, favors I for favors. Doesn't that sound enticing? You gotta stop using your fancy-ass rich people talk, okay? I'm trying to concentrate on not getting fucked in my A! I think that's what he's propositioning you about, though. Let me keep it simple. Once a month, on the full moon, you return the book to me, followed by a night of passionate fornication. That's definitely what he's propositioning. And you get to keep it all the rest of the time, hmm? Sound fair, my little imp? Fine, whatever! Oh, Blitz, I'm so... 
so excited. Blitz, that's his name. His name's Blitz. Okay, I gotta try to remember that. I cannot wait to feel your slimy c inside of my Kinky. So you're a little devil, huh? Wait, she's she has the butt of the gun like this. Oh, I was gonna say if it's pointing at her, just freaking pull the trigger. Come to drag me and my kin to hell. Well, not today, Satan! Gonna send y'all back where you came from. Y'all come back now, you hear? Billy! So he got out? <laughs> oh, I had that fucking shot. God damn it, Moxie. Satan, we return your filthy creatures back to the pits of hell. May the root of evil remain honored as we continue thy work. <laughs> so they're, they're like Satanists or something? So I don't, I don't think they'd be bothered by the heat, though, right? Like, does that make sense? I don't think they'd be bothered by the heat. Yeah, that's not exactly how it works, ladies. Sorry, your fire doesn't really hurt us, but, I mean, I could fake it if that'll get your dick hard. Oh. Shit. Well, I'll just shoot you in your smart-ass mouth! That would be more effective. Blitz! <laughs> Oh snap! Oh frig, it's brutal. See? You're not getting your goddamn paycheck for this one, Mox. So is that Moxie? Is that the other one's like wife or husband or something? Oh the yeah, thanks. Son? I'm fine. I'm sorry, sir. I compromised our objective and put us in harm's way. It won't happen again. I promise. Apology accepted. <laughs> But if you ever pull a stunt like this again, I will fuck you and your wife. All righty. <laughs> I mean, if you're into that, I guess. Hey, job well done. Now let's get off. Uh, yeah, give me a moment. Oh, it is, it is his wife. Moment. I need to get something I left at the house. Okay, fine, but hurry up. Luna, we're ready to come home, dear. Is he gonna go finish, finish the family off? What the frick did I just hear? Move. What are you gonna do, little guy? Kill us? I should. You people are monsters. But you should have a chance at a life and a purpose. Look at your children. They have their whole future ahead of them. You are going to face your crimes justly. I will call your earthly authorities, and they will make sure you are dealt with fairly. But, but what, but how? How would they get dealt with fairly? What have they done? I mean, yeah, they got some weird stuff in their bedrooms and they're, you know, doing some crazy crap, but that none of that, like, I don't think you'd be, they'd be able to find anything. I'm handling this my way. Oh, shit. Uh, do you, uh, do you have a phone to summon 911? Yeah, it's in the kitchen. Then what is this for? It's a universal remote. Got it for the kids. Aww. There he is. Have a good wank-off session, Moxie. Excuse me? Look, I don't care where you come in the living world. Just come to your job on time, all right? See you at the office. You doing okay, sweetie? Better now, honey. I think I just needed a minute to process. You have a good heart, honey. Just a fuzzy head. Oh, how adorable. We got it, boys! Holy crap, so much for, uh, so much for innocent until proven guilty. <laughs> Just blew them up. What did he say? Oh, did you see my little Mox Mox? Oh, yeah. Oh, Moxie, 
Well, here's to another mission accomplished, and Moxie finally learned not to fuck up. And killing people isn't that big a deal if they try to kill you back. That's messed up. But I paid for it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fuck that family. I actually really like this show. I wonder if there are any, like, I don't really know any big names, so I wouldn't be able to, uh, I wouldn't be able to, Brand, Brand Rogers, Brand Rogers wrote it? Is Brand Rogers one of the main, they, I guess maybe one of the main, there's so many names, I don't know names, anyway, I think this is fantastic, I think I'd rate this out of a 10, it's obviously the first episode, so I have to, I'm they're using this as a base point, so I'd probably say like a 7, but in all honesty, it's gotta be higher, it's gotta be like an 8. It's so well done. The comedy, the graphics, the animation, fantastic. Even the colors, all the, the this animation I really like because the colors all blend together. Like no matter what scene I go to, all of the colors blend together and they work well together, which is what you want in an animation. It looks so good. And uh, yeah, I think I'd rate this out of a 10, probably at like, wait, I just said that, like an eight. And uh, yeah, with that being said, if you like this, give it a thumbs up, subscribe. Go subscribe to Vizipop if you like this. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time.